Hey guys, hope you're all well. Hope you're all good in the hood. And today's video, I want to talk about perfectionists. And, you know, everything has to be perfect, doesn't it, sometimes? And maybe that's holding you back. It's like yesterday, I, um, me and Amy, we had a really good chat on that interview. And I was like, oh, maybe it's a little bit cringy. And but then again, I thought to myself, well, it's something I can learn from, people can learn from, and there's different conversations in there that um, do point out the um, difference between men and dating on dynamics. And for me, it was like, oh, well, because uh, I, I need to definitely sort my, um, when I do my like interview chats there, I've got like my, my, my lighting isn't so flattering. Whereas Amy, she had a really good setup. So for me, it's like, oh, well, I need to change it. I need to get better lights and stuff like that. That will come with time. I'm aware of that. But it's like, it's that kind of thing that's holding me back. It's like saying, no, it needs to be the right lighting, the right picture. It's like the other day, did some gym footage. Really good. I think the videos turned out really well. Uh, lighting was on point. But then we did some post-workout photos. And uh, there was one photo in there. Was like, I was like stunning there. It's like a, a little boy being told off. I thought, oh, man, that's not good. But sometimes it's how the cookie crumbles and you can't, you're not always gonna get it right. And at the same time, if it isn't always how would you wanna be that kind of perfect kind of look or image or content, sometimes you just gotta put it out there and show consistency. And I think that's the great thing about like stories on Instagram and stuff like that is that um, some people's stories do look pretty damn good but stories that come across quite real like you know when you're talking to the camera or you're showing it's it's kind of like a point of view thing and it, it kind of just shows people what you're about it's a little clip of maybe you're talking or what you're up to it's um kind of gives that bit of realism to what what's going on but i think like perfectionism it's it's something that we probably some people suffer from but in some cases i think um, I need to be a bit more perfectionism. I need to think that I probably could have picked a different image or different content or different, probably could have gotten that about a different way. I know sometimes I do struggle, you know, I'm not perfect at English. My grammar, my typing skills, sometimes I, I misspell things or miss words out. Um, and that is something that I need to work on because I'm like, I'm generally sometimes I'm rushing to type the message. I want to move on to the next thing. But maybe if I just took a few seconds longer, then especially if somebody who doesn't know me, I'm typing to somebody new, they might not understand what I'm saying. So yeah, perfect, perfectionism is something that is a good thing and a bad thing. But ultimately, I think you've just got to get that message out there and, and put the content. This is the thing what I struggle with doing these daily videos. It's like, oh man, I, I don't know what to say. I, I'm not sure what kind of content I want to talk about today. Um, it's like, oh, what do I say? But ultimately, I know that I've just got to get on the camera and start talking, and then something's going to come, something's going to stick. I'm going to hit that flow state like I've talked before, and then I'm just going to, because I like talking on camera, I like being passionate, I like bringing content. So I know ultimately it's just a case of getting the ball rolling, and then something's going to gonna flow. So, guys, we'll leave it there. Hope you're having a great week, and I will see you for tomorrow's vid. Thank you.